What's up everybody, FC here from Drone Tech Review. And today I am gonna talk about the image tracking of the DJI Neo. But there's one problem, right? I am, I have to walk backwards. Uh-huh, because you, know, you, you can't see my face. So this is the, the main tracking of DJI Mini and it's very good. It's very good at it because uh, it can track you, it can uh, recover, uh, it, it follows, it doesn't care, it's low, it doesn't care if um, it bumps into things, uh, but the weakness is it, uh, you can't see your face. All right, so now I'm gonna go direction track, which is another way of tracking. Okay, what I wanna do now is film direction track and how it works. So we put it there, I have it set to medium height medium distance and high and there you go so it's setting up and right here you got to set up meaning you got to start moving and the reason you got to start moving is basically when you're done um you just stand still and, and that's when it's over let me check this guy too so uh-huh So it's trying to get the straight ahead of me. If I turn right, it's going to try to turn right, trying to get ahead of me. And you know, that's really cool. It's, it's really tracking my direction. Okay, we're going to go in the woods. And what I'm going to do, this is very dangerous, but I'm going to try to steer it um, with as if I had a tether, as if I had a stick. So I know there's trees there, so I'm going to go here, expecting him to go this way. When he gets really confused, he just does follow. He goes, I don't know where you're going, or there's a lot of trees. So we'll have him do that. On this kind of situation, it's better to have it lower. Um, okay, let me try. Okay, okay. To steer him backwards. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. There's just too many obstacles here, so I'm gonna to try to make a. Oh, I'm gonna to go right. As I turn right, he turns right too, and that is pretty amazing. So basically, you have to train yourself as well how to work with a drone. So I'm gonna turn right, and he's gonna turn right. I'm gonna turn left, and he's gonna turn left. <laughs> uh, that's so cool. Turning right, turning right. You know, turn right up until. Yeah, he's at the spot where you want it to be and then go from there. Oh man, that's not bad. That's not bad at all. Oh, by the way, we want to face the sun. So how do we face the sun? Oh, there we go. Okay. So I'm trying to uh, face the sun. So you somehow you have to get around it. There we go. So I got around it and now hopefully you're going to direction track me again. So this was buggy during release, but they had a fix for it. So now it's working pretty darn good. You know what I wanna do is I wanna try direction track while I'm biking. Uh, and then we'll do the follow mode as well. Because for, for my job, which is reviewing bikes, you wanna be able to see the bike. Uh, you wanna be able to see the rider, not just the back of me, right? Okay, okay. So he's probably trying to figure out what direction is he going. And when you get, when he gets behind me, somehow I need to turn that around, right? <laughs> okay. Just follow me. Let's just do the follow mode of direction track. And then we're gonna go through the woods here. So this is a core strength of the DJI Mini. Like I wouldn't even dare go in here with my Mini 4 Pro 
uh, because there's too many trees. But this thing, it doesn't really care. Okay, I figured out what to do is I need to be standing still and I need to turn around. Okay. Uh, how do I turn the light off? Okay. All right, this is direction track, and uh, I'm biking. Uh huh. It's on low mode, and it's just going ahead of me, and it's pretty wooded, as you can see. So the way direction track works is it tries to figure out where you're going, uh, and then oh, how do we get out of the trees here? And then, and then it tries to get ahead of you. Super cool, really super cool. Um, but the big thing that it does, so try to get, so, I've, it, so I see him turning left and now it's going to say, okay, he's turning left. Uh, let me get ahead of him. So it always tries to get ahead of you, which is the genius behind this, uh, little machine here. Uh, but the minute you stop, it's going to assume, okay, he wants to get me back. So when you stop is when it, um, uh, it stops, it turns off direction track. And that's what my problem with direction track before was I wasn't moving, so it kept stopping. And I'm like, what the heck going on? All right, I'm gonna try to make a U-turn. Ah, it really, it really tries to get ahead of you. So I'm turning right and it tries to make a bigger right. Uh-huh. Ah. So the key is making sudden moves. Get ahead of me, my friend. So, wow, that's interesting. Oh, this is really good for my bike reviews because now I can really be biking and it's gonna film me. I should adjust the height of this thing, direction track, and, uh, because at, at this altitude, it is pretty darn low. Something really cool, <laughs> not really cool, but a side effect of this drone being so loud is it's like, I know it's still there because you can hear it. Okay. This is cool. Almost bumped into me. So it's so good at following you that you can't get into ahead of me mode unless you make a U-turn. And you have to do it quick, otherwise the thing's gonna turn off on you or it's gonna turn off direction track. Wow, this is fascinating. So here, I'm going right, so I wanted to get ahead of me on the right. Oh my God, this is so cool. So go right, go ahead of me. Uh, okay, now it's ahead of me. Okay. Now, now it's on the right side. So I just learned how to steer direction track. Oh, uh, that's so cool.